your NBC 26 update. I'm Stacey Angabretson. A former used car dealer from Green Bay has been charged with 15 counts of fraud in federal court. 37-year-old John Solberg is accused of convincing people who were selling their cars on Craigslist to turn over their vehicles to be sold on consignment, then selling the cars without the owner's approval or knowledge. Prosecutors say Solberg then allegedly created counterfeit titles, allowing the buyer to believe they own the vehicle free and clear of any liens. Solberg faces decades in prison and a million dollars in fines if convicted. One out of every three families in the U.S. serves some kind of salad on Thanksgiving, but this year the CDC is telling people to leave romaine lettuce off the menu due to an E. coli outbreak. According to the CDC, 27 additional cases of E. coli have now been reported, bringing the total to 67 cases in 19 states. 21 of those cases are from Wisconsin. The outbreak has been linked to romaine lettuce grown in Salinas, California. Some travelers hitting the road today for their Thanksgiving destinations are finding snow-covered roads and high winds. Areas north and west of Green Bay look like a winter wonderland. In the UP, Stevenson Area Public Schools closed Wednesday due to the conditions. Cameron Moreland has been tracking this system for us. And Cameron, what's the latest? Well, Stacy, the big storm is pulling away from Wisconsin and everything is winding down slowly but surely as far as the precipitation is concerned and also the gusty winds after early morning highs in the lower to mid 40s. Temperatures have now dropped into the 30s. You can see even colder weather off to the north and west. So as we progress through the rest of the afternoon and early evening, some on and off rain and snow showers are possible. Winds still gusting 40 to 50 miles per hour, but decreasing once we get past sunset. Overnight, we'll see slow clearing tomorrow for Thanksgiving. Look for a mixture of clouds and some sunshine during the morning and early afternoon. Clouding up as we head towards evening. High temperatures will be seasonable, mainly in the mid 30s. That's exactly where we should be for this time of year. For your very latest new sports and weather, make sure you download the NBC 26 News app. It's free, it's available in the App Store and on Google Play. Just search for WGBA. Have a great day and happy Thanksgiving.